yesterday we left San Ignacio, dropped our rental car off in Belize City, and then got a ride to the San Pedro Express where we hopped on a ferry boat to bring us to San Pedro. Then it was a long day of journeys, so we got some dinner and kind of just relaxed. So this morning we hopped on the San Pedro Express to get to Key Cocker. Which is an island not too far from where we're staying on our other island. It was only about a 30 minute ferry ride and now we're gonna head first to check out some tarpoon fish. We do, yeah, we do three, yeah. Um, a foot over the water, they will come and take it off your hand, okay? There's no teeth in the mouth. The inside of your mouth is like rough sandpaper, and the mouth is like a hard shell. So when they come up to take this, sometimes the mouth, well, the mouth opens so wide, sometimes it hits the palm of your hands. It's like giving you a hard high five. You're gonna be fine. <laughs> if you do get a scratch, it's going to be a surface scratch only because okay. the inside of the mouth is like rough sandpaper. Okay? Right. Ah! Are you balling it? Oh! <laughs> One foot, you're like two feet, babe. I know. I'm scared! <laughs> <laughs> Shift that thing fast, Bobby. I can't. That was a big one. You see that? That was big. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't look at them. Ah! It touched me! I did it! Alright guys, so we just got done feeding the tarpon. It was a super cool experience. I actually did it after like 15 <laughs> 20 fish. Yeah. Um, but super cheap as 250 American dollars for six fish. Um, so definitely worth it. And a fun few fun facts about it is they live over a hundred years old. And um, they date prehistoric and they live in salt water or fresh water. Pretty cool fish. Next stop is ice and beans for some fresh donuts and coffee. We tried a couple things here at the ice and beans place, starting with a rum ball. Tastes a little rummy. Yeah, you just it, it tastes good. It's like good rum. You want any more? No. All right. That's good. These are pretty good. They're nice, fresh, warm, and so soft. We got our donuts and a rum ball and some coffee. And now we're heading to the split, we're, but we're gonna stop at some souvenir shops on the way. Just got done checking out the split. The Lazy Lizard restaurant was pretty busy. 
see and there wasn't much for seating in the shade so we are gonna go check out some of the restaurants we passed that had some more water seating options we made it to the sip and dip they had a special two for 12 on drinks um so we're gonna chill here they have water tables Try to push you. <laughs> We had a ton of fun at the Sip and Dip. Uh, spent a good like hour, hour and a half there. Just chilling, getting some drinks, had the nachos there. Very chill atmosphere, very Super cool. Yummy. Sit in the water, at the bench, amazing. Uh, we're gonna try some street food now and then get ready to get on the, the Water Express to get back to our hotel. We got the food and it was kind of cool because they walked us to the grocery store to pay by card and then they just give them the money and they work really well together which I thought was kind of cool. We really have a sit down spot there so we're heading back to the ice and beans. It's like a shady spot so Chris can eat. Well I guess I got corn so, so we both can eat um, our lunch before hopping back on the boat and heading back to Sam Hayden. Hi guys, we're going to the barbecue chicken, uh, sausage, and corn from the street vendors over there. Uh, they had an open grill charcoal, look delicious, that's what we're doing for lunch today. And it was like $15.75. The street food, I don't even know what the name of the place was, was delicious. This wraps up our time here in Key Cocker. It was a fun little day trip and I definitely would come back to this island um, to stay for a week, maybe in the future. It's a different vibe than San Pedro and I really liked it. Yeah, the food here was fresher, more uh, more affordable, better prices here. It's just a nice island chill theme, uh, good island vibes going on here. Definitely uh, recommend coming here. We'll definitely be back again probably. So make sure to like and subscribe to see the rest of our Belize series. Uh, see you next week. <laughs>